What the Freak is Up, Denny's Eidolon have dropped their new album finally, Eviscerate. This is going to be Swancore Magic. Uh, this is the first part of a double album, I believe, that they're going to work on the next part. It'll probably be out next year. Um, real excited for both of these. But yeah, we've heard like two singles, I think, so we got a full fucking album. Um, it's pretty rare that a band doesn't drop half the album in singles, but I appreciate them. Let's check this motherfucker out. Let's go. All right. Whew. Andrew Swells and the crew. We got Latin for the intro. I, I don't know the lore for this band. I know there's more. I'm not following the lore. It leads to the conclusion that war is inevitable. Speech. That mankind is doomed. That we are gripped by forces we cannot control. I'm going to guess this is going to be a heavy album. The singles are pretty heavy for Swancore. Um, it's called a vessel rate, so... And man can be as big as he wants. No problem of human destiny. Excited. Is beyond human beings, man's reason and spirit. Andrew has one of the best voices ever. <laughs> Maybe not ever, but it's fucking crazy. Bridge of Iron and Blood. Sounds like a Game of Thrones title. The inevitable triumph. So help us God. I have fallen and I was made to suffer. I will watch as everything that I love dies. I have run and I was ground down to nothing. I am and I was made to suffer. I will watch this baseline. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Fuck yeah. Let's turn it up a little. Ooh. Starting out aggressive. This is metalcore. Chilling on the beach. Time to fucking his voice. Insane. to the Latin. What are we doing right now? Thank you. 
Sergio play bass in this band? I know he does in Dance, Gavin Dance. guitar for this band, right? These, these guys are in so many bands, I can't keep up. Ooh, <laughs> oh, singles. I don't think I need to mention how good the guitar is. It's Swan Core. And Drew, have, have my babies. This is a fucking chorus. You know, I wasn't even that big on past Idola albums, but holy shit, they stepped it up for this one. This part feels very Dance Gavin Dance. Recent. The DGD. How many men will die trying to make this right? You'll be. I assume they have the same producer. How many men will die trying to make this right? Focus. That fucks, man. Am I the only one without a stone to throw? I'm giving up a kid to find out what I've always known. God tell me how. Am I the only one? With nothing left to say, with nothing left to give, it only sends this way. The price I'll always pay. And then he goes the into the. Pay. Goes into Tillian range. Got a lot of practice in when he was lead vocalist on uh, DGD's tour. <laughs> That's cool. Not quite as high as Tony, but who is? Now I'm moving on. I don't 
This one also has Dance Gavin vibes. I feel like Swancore has been incredible lately. This band, Wolf and Bear, um, Hell the Sun, it's been crazy. Andrew is so good. Little breakdown at the end, also very dance camera dance. All right, all new songs from here on out. He is a fortress, that's true. It's just straight up metalcore. The screen sounds pretty pissed. Which is unusual for Swancore.
Uf. The strings, ties, and not. That's all. The way to sin. Pretty good. This whole album is just flexing. Vocals, guitar, flexing. Ooh. 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 Acoustic. Lick. Part is pretty. Oh, man. Oh, beautiful. Oh, please give me more Andrew over over this guitar. Please stop in that word. Well, we're riffing. I love the acoustic part. Next track, Fistful of Hornets, which I believe we have a video for, which I will switch over. All right, Fistful of Hornets. They're playing in a hive. They got PQ for suits. Oh shit, smash him. He's got flowers. Are they for me? Silly.
very angry screams. Andrew has high, high key uh, Johnny Craig energy in his performances. Oh, glass beads? Maybe. What the fuck? We're gonna smash. Oh fuck. Oh we are! Holy shit. Oh, this is so so genty. That's fucking heavy for Swamp Core. Holy shit. Whoa, whoa. God takes away everything. Piano? Piano ballad? With Andrew? <laughs> we are so heavy on this one. What is this? Put the fucking grit in his voice. Ooh. 
god. Cigarette. Hell of a riff. Thick one. Thick, chunky riff. Ooh. I'm loving these vibey parts. So chill, so relaxing. Sick. Ashes and... I don't know. <laughs> I can't. You'll do what to me? I will come for you again. You'll do what? Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah. Fucking hell! Sheesh! You gonna pop off? We about to pop? Yep! Whoa! Oh my 
Oh my god. I thought this was Swan Corps. Are we gonna break down again? It's nuts! Guys, this album is heavy. Song is not over. Ooh, That's a cool fucking outro. That was a crazy song. <laughs> Whoa. Very progressive. All right, Kali Yuga. Love it already. Kings of the earth Oh yeah Tell me how you're breaking me down Tell me that it's good for my health Things will never be the same We're close to what you 
This one, huh? Golgotha Compendium? Fifth Temple, is this like a bit of part five of songs? Heavy. Fuck. with reality because they confuse the world as it is with the world as they think about it and talk about it and describe it for on the one hand there is the real world and on the other a whole system of symbols about that world which we have in our minds these are very very useful symbols all civilization depends on them unlike all like tool Ooh, 
Andrew. Turning me on with these low vocals. Bring the riff back. chance I'm pronouncing this next one. The Burden of Wisdom. That first word? No, uh huh Piano ballad? For real? Instrumental outro is the last track. I'll be damned. Very beautiful piano track. Idola, Eviscerate. That was a very solid swancore album. Leaning more towards metalcore. There was a lot of heavy, a lot of breakdowns, actually. <laughs> Pretty crazy. Kind of an angry swancore album. Um, yeah. Pretty fucking good. 
On first listen, at least, I wasn't as big on the non-singles, but maybe with re-listens, it'll, it'll pick up and grow on me, um, like most albums do. But, but yeah, definitely fucking great, solid album. Quite a ride. Quite, these songs were pretty, pretty progressive. Um, yeah, pretty interesting. Um, I need to delve into the lyrical content, because I know there's lore, but I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, pretty, pretty fucking sick. Andrew, sounds amazing, as usual. Instruments were amazing. I mean, yeah, Swancore. It's always next level. It's always crazy. But yeah, hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, uh, comment down below to me what your favorite track was off this album. Um, check out my other channels. Links in the description for those. I'll say Patreon if you want to support the channel. It's a dollar. I uh, do appreciate it if you decided to do that. Um, upload videos over there that get blocked here. Go support Idolist, stream the music, buy the merch, see them live if you get the chance. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye and good luck.